Hello friends of the Northern Entertainment and welcome to another episode of my train simulator series. We are today driving a class... class... 3... 4 something or another on the Isle of Wight. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I really don't know what class train that is, but... Um, we are departing at... Uh, 2.13 p.m. here from uh, Wright St. John's Road 2. And... Uh, oh no, why not? I am... Sadly mistaken. We are supposed to arrive in three minutes there. Alright, in that case... Please, please, thank you. Let's go. Let's go. Reverser. Front. Let's go. Oops. It's a little bit tricky. Well, it's, it's not really tricky. This is probably one of the easiest trains you can have. There is not much to it. You have a speed gauge. You have your train brakes. You have a reverser. And you have a power handle. There you go. But, uh, yeah, I guess on this, uh, on this line, um, it's somewhat of a, no a nostalgic ride, uh, where you can, where you can ride this train. Um, I forgot to turn the headlights on. Wonderful. There we go. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, it, this is part one. Um, I know you guys want to see... Oops. Nice. Very nice. Um, I know you guys want to see steam trains soon, and I said I'm gonna do that. But... Uh, this is kinda leading up to it. Because this scenario that I'm driving right now is uh, this old-timer train uh, goes to... Now, let me think. I can't remember what the station is. I want to say St. John's, but I might be wrong. Um, however, there is a steam train waiting. And uh, so... Yeah, we're gonna... Go and uh, meet up with this train up there. And uh, from there on, I'm gonna use the steam train. Not in this episode, though, because uh, this run up there, if I make it somewhat in time, which doesn't look like it, because I'm already running a minute and some late, according to the ETA. But uh, it will be around 30 minutes. Now obviously, with cutting and whatnot, might be less. I might have slowed down too soon. Hmm, no, maybe not. But as you can see, I'm using my track IR. Because I use that thing for pretty much everything now. Well, everything where I can use it anyway. And again, here's the disclaimer. I'm not a train engineer by any stretch of the imagination. I'm getting by here as best as I can. I kind of figured out signals for the UK. Because they are fairly easy, they are kind of... Or at least for some lines, they are fairly straightforward. You have red, yellow and... Uh, green. There we are. Minus 83. Yay! And nobody's getting in and out of our train. Well then. Wonderful. Wonderful. I'm sticking my big head out of the window if you guys, guys are wondering what the heck is he doing. 
There's a lot of old trains, I gotta say. No, oh, there we go. Off to races. Ah, uh, let's go. There is really no easy starting this. Next stop is braiding. Breading? No, braiding. So. Yeah, this is all very, very rustic, to say the very least. And as you probably can see there in the right, upper right hand corner, uh, I am broadcasting this live on Steam as I'm recording, which I do every now and again. Come on, speed up. Speed limit is 45, so we're gonna go 43 or so. That's a nice easy run for somebody like me. <laughs> really the only thing I have to worry about is not being on time, which I'm already running late, so I hope I can make up a little bit of time. But we'll see. I'm definitely very excited that you guys uh, so far, well, except for a few, but that's normal. But for the most part, you guys seem to like the new series. Um, I certainly enjoy it. And I'm speeding. There. Minus six points. Not too, too bad. Um, but yeah, I do really enjoy playing the... I wonder what that is all about here. Hmm. Interesting. No idea. And we are coming up to 40. Which I would assume there should be a sign here. Somewhere on this side. Looks like a yield sign almost with a 40. But we might have just blown past it while I was looking all around the place instead of watching the track. Which, guess what, as a train conductor or as a train engineer, you're supposed to watch what you're doing. Big shocker there, I know. Ah, there it is. 40 coming up. Will I make it without speeding? Yes, I will. Har har. Look at me. Oh man. Me and my big mouth. I guess this is a little bit of a incline here. Oh come on, I'm already in a negative so much. Plus I have to make up time so... Ah, no. There. Oh, wait a second. 20 is coming up. Oh yeah, and you can see here that depending on how much uh, the speed drops, it seems like... Uh, oh, come on, will you speed... Uh, will you drop the speed? Minus 200 and... Oh my goodness gracious, oh well. Now we gotta slow down here to 20 anyways. Oh, this is going to be close. Nope, not gonna happen. We're gonna still get speeding. Come on. Oh, 
I have no idea what the rules and regulations are for UK trains in terms of uh, no, in terms of whistling. But I'm pretty sure somebody will know and somebody will tell me. Oh, please come to a stop. 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 Oh, no, it's not gonna go over well. I'm overshooting. No. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. What a terrible run. Duh. Wow, there is really, there is absolutely no gentle start or stop of this. Well, stop, yes, but start? Uh-uh. It's just jumpy like crazy. There we are. I don't even want to know how much time I lost because of that nonsense. Let's see. We were supposed to be there. Oh, two minutes late. Ha oh, oh, ha oh. ha. Two minutes late. Okay, well, let's not waste any more time and let's get going. This handle here reminds me a little bit of the the metro trains in, in uh, New York. It's probably the same kind of idea. Alright, let's roll. nice well the little that you see anyway i still hope we make it to sundown before or sundown sundown sorry not sundown before uh, the steam train arrives yeah we are late now we should be yeah we should be arriving right now so we're going to be probably Oh, uh, probably gonna be a minute late still. And as you can see here, speed limit 15 miles coming up. Starting to decelerate here again. Doop de doop de doo. There we go. just roll out here towards uh, Sandown. Oh look, there is another train waiting to go. So he's probably pretty annoyed with us right now.
Oh boy. That's what I get for not paying attention. Minus nine, as if I don't have already enough. Okay. Made it to another's destination with minus nine, uh, 394 points. Can't get, can't get much worse. Boarding complete, and off we go. Oh my goodness. Every time this thing starts up, it's too funny. Let's roll. <laughs> One thing is for certain, Track IR definitely promotes a good posture. We are rather slow, so I don't think really there is the need. The need to whistle much, but I guess. What do I know? Oh, finally, I can speed up. Once the last car is past the threshold there. There we go. I guess we don't have to worry about wheel spin at all. Oh man, minus 786. Can't get much worth worse. That signal doesn't say anything because it looks in the other direction. I'm gonna accelerate to 30. Oh, that was maybe too much already. I kinda don't wanna be dawdling around because I already lost enough time, thank you very much. There we go. Looks more like it. And yes, yes, I know, I know. Doesn't look re very realistic when people get on and off, but this is a train simulator and not passenger get on and off simulator. So give it a break. Okay, and I will do so right away. Hopefully we can make some time up. I don't think we will, but...
quite the interesting uh, <laughs> railroad crossings they got here. And there comes Shanklin up, which I guess is our last stop since the track stops. Yeah, I should maybe take the power out of it then. Well, that was fun. Now I just hope we can come to a stop in a timely manner. Hopefully before the steam train anyway. Otherwise, we lost the race. Slowly coming here into the station. Don't see a steam train yet, so... Yep, that's definitely the end of the line. Right there. Minus 866. Of course, as soon as you start losing time, there's just nothing you can do anymore. But okay. Well, our last stop was here. I think, unless they make us go back. Which I'm not sure if they do or not. If they do, we have to switch... Yay. Minus 18, well. Lake? Yep, we do, in fact. If you are ready late uh, to leave 1436, okay, well, I guess we have the great opportunity to um, switch sides. Now, how in the world was that again? There. Alright, so let's try to make our way back in a timely fashion. Leaving in... you know what? We're gonna leave in... We're gonna leave 45 seconds early because... Well, because... And off we go. Not gonna start this off with a time uh, with a penalty. Here we go. Oh wow, it looks like an old version, old angry, bummed out version of Liam Nielsen. I don't even know, I don't even want to know. Here we go, 
Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Come on. Slow down. Well, this is going to be one of those episodes, I guess. A longer one. Which I know some of you like, some of you don't. Oh, I completely forgot that I have to slow down here. I'm supposed to pick people up in 10, 9, 8, 7. Oh boy. Oh, have to hit the brakes here. Better hold on to your seats, guys. There we go. How late are we? Weird sounds. I mean, in general, I do like the sounds, but this sounds weird. And in case you are wondering, this is an electronic train. I think this rail here would be the one that gives you the power. Why does that take so long? Look at this. I'm going to look out of the window meanwhile. Are you people getting in or what? Hmm. I am deeply confused why this takes so long. Well, guys, this is definitely going to be a point where I'm cutting because I have no idea what's take what's going on here. So we are 1440 Lake, okay, which is in 20 seconds. In 20 seconds, people, so hurry up. 10 seconds. No, go away. Why does this take so long? I'm late, people. Off we go. Now, of course, we're gonna be coming up. Whoa! Nice little bump there. Uh, now, of course, we're gonna be coming up on uh, Sandown, which which uh, has this 15 miles per hour speed limit.
<laughs> Eventually I'm gonna get used to all this. Now this one is going faster. Thank goodness. A little bit faster anyway. It's interesting. This is really... Well, I guess they, they weren't that fancy. Back then, those trains... Because boy oh boy, this train is anything but fancy. Yes, the signals allow it, so let's go. That's the nice thing about... Uh, about electronic tra trains though, as soon as you take the power away, they are just coasting instantly. to say that kind of scared me now because I didn't well I heard a train I thought I heard another train but uh, there is only one track so yeah naturally that made me wonder Windshield wiper works too. Oh, we're making time up anyway. Th 
that route is uh, Isle of Wight. Should maybe let the people out too. It's a ghost train. Go. I tell you, there's really Let's go. Well, we're minus 562, so I guess there's room for improvement, but it's definitely getting better. Just time that right. timing at all. there. Gonna have 45 all the way to the station, so I'm probably gonna start slowing down at 0.3 miles from the station. Might be a little bit too late though. Brains and uh, brakes are not the best.
<laughs> oh no, that was too early. Come on. Marburg Junction 1. So I don't know what's next. Let's see. Last one. Oh no, that's it. The end. So to say. The end, my friends. And uh, yeah, since this is our last stop, I say already... Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this episode, then please hit that like button. For those that joined me here live and watched the broadcast, I hope you guys had a little bit of fun and enjoyed what you've seen. Again, I'm not a train engineer by any stretch of the imagination, but I try to get slowly better. And yeah, next episode... Exactly. Most of the passengers disembark here for the disembark here for the steam train, which should arrive shortly. They thank you for the pleasant journey. You can follow what happens on the steam railway by taking the role of their driver in part two, and that is exactly what we will do um, next time around. Steam for all your steam lovers out there. So until next time, I say thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and God bless you.